Feeling <laughs> romantic now. <laughs> Feeling romantic now. <laughs> oh, oh <okay>. no! <laughs> he, says, he says he's feeling all romantic. He's oh like, my God. no. It's romance he's getting his own Uber back home. Yeah, I like the I like the raspberry. You like the raspberry? And you guys, which ones do you like? Uh, I, I like the blueberry. Blueberry. Blueberry is your romance. He's like, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a great day. You too. <clears throat> okay, definitely have some water, people. Because we're going to introduce the ice wine. So remember that technique that I was showing you at the beginning? Where you smell it in your mouth closed and your mouth open? I want you to check it out before you drink it. Because you won't get the same effect if you drink it right away before you test it out. Alright. Okay. Oof. I actually started to feel it. <laughs> I know! I was just saying that before. I'm sorry. Yo, that's why. Good. She's trying to get a <laughs> Look at the so line. Beautiful. Basically what you're gonna awesome. do is to smell it uh, with your mouth closed and then do it again with your mouth open. This is ice wine you said? Yeah. This is ice wine. 30 pounds of grapes go into that. Now, when you drink it, drink it very slowly, especially those who've never had ice wine before, it's gonna be super sweet. 30 pounds of grapes compared to four or five pounds of grapes. Okay, so it's very condensed flavor like you saw. You're gonna get honey, pineapple, and lychee. Oh, now when I say those flavors, <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, this is a Canadian tequila shot. <coughs> Ooh, that's, that's good. That's my cup of tea, right? Wow. Now, right? But now you know why I say don't don't die over it. Over it. <laughs> I totally it. inhaled it. Wow, that's oh, good. Delicious. Okay. This is my cup of tea. Mm -hmm. So when I say honey, pineapple, lychee, I'm not I'm not we don't put those flavors in it. That's what you get with the grapes when it's Dance, yeah, 30 pounds, right? So I'm, I'm trying wow. to um, have your brain and your taste buds explain what's going on there. Okay, good. Okay, so good. we suggest preparing with that um, strawberries, kiwi, soft cheeses like brie. Mm. You come back when we have our little platter, we have kiwi and we have brie. This one is which one? Yeah. Oh, yeah, so we, we usually do. What yeah. are those called? When yeah, what they usually they give you they pair it for you, but uh, because of COVID they can't do it right now. So yeah, that makes sense. I always say platter because I have trouble saying it too. Right? It's just one of the meat plate. Sometimes it's in there and sometimes it's in there. I think it's a charcuterie board. That's good ice wine. I just call it. So this one is what? Uh, sir, what what was this one this, called? That one is Riesling Chardonnay. Oh, Riesling. Okay, the first one. one. Okay, so I've got one more ice wine for you guys. 69 like bucks. That. Now, I'm going to do the red ice wine. That's the last one on the list there. Um, it's going to be Merlot Cabernet Sauvignon. Merlot Cabernet Sauvignon. Now, the first one, like I said, matches well with fruit and cheese. This one pairs well with dark chocolate. So if you love dark chocolate, then this is your thing. <laughs> <laughs> now, this we use 60 pounds of grapes on this one. Um, because the skins are, remember I said the skins are thicker, so you get less juice. So you need to be committed. Only about 20 wineries in the world make red ice wine, and most of them are in Canada. So a lot of people that have had ice wine before still have not tried a red yet. <clears throat> so on the nose, you're going to get rose and cherry. When you taste it, raise your hair on marmalade. Mm. Uh, and we usually have dark chocolate with our platter, so that's why I was like, come back and we got the food because it works really nice. So basically, you have a sip. Then you eat a piece of chocolate, and then you have another sip of wine. It's going to take you to a new place. It's like traveling without moving your feet. We're going to try this again after COVID when you can yeah, actually have the yeah. <laughs> sampler plate. We might, we might be putting, um, we, we look chatting a little bit. We're thinking uh, we might do our platter in the summertime, but we're not sure yet. So just call back and check with us. Yeah. But it's worth it. It's a nice platter. It's like three types of olives. Um, we've got Azeco cheese, brie cheese, hummus. Two types of crackers, mm. uh, some cured ham. Wow. Um, <laughs> Just a lot of chocolate. stuff. That's a lot. It's, and it's really yummy. We're all getting thin. You can really eating it ourselves. It's, <laughs> it's good. It's a really good platter. They're okay. on a stricter so diet. Sure you have that sip of water. Um, because this is a very different 
Okay. Yeah, she's like, gotta get up there and get my wine. I said, push me out of the way. Yeah, this is just nice for you. Okay, so May 3rd, you should be starting on this face again. Sorry. Okay. It smells kind of like soy sauce. No, soy sauce. Soy sauce. Wow, yeah. That was, uh, I mean, he's a crazy one over here, right? Yeah. So it's going to be like a sweet whiskey almost, right? So have you ever had a sweet whiskey? It's good and delicious. But it's 100% ice wine. Um, you, can. you can. And when you have the chocolate with it, oh my god, it changes. That's very sweet. Is what this is? This so one? Amazing. Merlot Cabernet Sauvignon. Oh, that's oh, so good. Oh, there ain't no soy sauce. Mascarón. Uh huh. It's the most expensive one. It's good. Soy sauce? What kind of soy sauce are you getting? <laughs> the good stuff, I don't know. <laughs> so you wow, see, that's very good. Yeah, and now you good. can boast that you've had a red ice wine because people have been tasting rice wine for years and they've never had a red. I didn't you even know it came in red. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. So imagine when you have a dark chocolate. We give you Ooh. dark chocolate too, right? Yeah, I like mm. that. So it's it's worth it. And Chase, if you like it now, like uh, I'd be so excited to give you chocolate because I've had people go, oh, that's not for me. I'll just try it with the chocolate, and then they love it. Now, the pictures other thing I remember is because it comes for food. You get your choice of either salmon jerky with oh. pepper flakes or maple chocolate whiskey. Oh. You let me know which one you like. Each person gets one. Wow. Okay, chocolate, chocolate, girl. chocolate girl. Chocolate. I'll definitely take the jerky. Jerky. The chocolate. <laughs> I love jerky. So I purchased the wine but then I get to choose from any of these trees a card. <laughs> I don't know where to go. And uh, I can win any one of these prizes. Let's, let's do the right one. Uh, yeah, sure. Which one calls my attention? This one way down here actually calls my attention. Alright, okay. Let's just up. open it. Did you, what color did you take? Uh, goldish. Is there anything inside? Oh, come on. Oh, let's see what you got. I got a... I don't know what that is. Let's see. <laughs> Congratulations, you got a sanitizer. <laughs> oh. You got one of these. It's for red wine. Ooh. Oh. So, since you don't drink oh, red we'll wine, see. you're probably going to give it to someone else. What did you it's get? It's an aerator. So basically, it aerates oh, the wine. I nice. didn't use it on the bottle because it was aerated enough. Okay. So when you freshen it in the bottle, then basically you run the wine through that. He knows oh. exactly what it is because he went up. I should have I let you choose for me. Okay, so I got sanitizer. <laughs> so, buy another <laughs> present. Buy another bottle and then take another one. Oh, drive. you can only do it once a week. <laughs> uh, yeah. So the only way I you can do another job is sanitizer. 75%, okay, you can drink that. Thank <laughs> you so much. Some of you are probably wondering right now, wine sampling? I thought you're diabetic. Well, I am. Uh, it is a little bit bad for me. I mean, wine is made out of grapes. Grapes have a lot of sugar. They're high in sugar. But it was little samples. You saw the glasses in the video. I got friends who are diabetics and they have at least a glass a day. They say it's perfectly fine. I feel fine still. A little tipsy, but I feel good. Hopefully it doesn't really mess me up too bad. We'll see. It's gonna be a test in progress. Thanks for watching and look out for the next video coming soon.